Make sure you stand till the end guys, we'll share common mistakes people make that can cost you thousands of dollars in damages. Stay with us, we'll explain what we're talking about. Hey guys, welcome back to Free Car Repair. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video to any of you having a Ford Escape. That generation right here from year 2013 to year 2019. If you have one of those, you have a problem where a headlight left or right headlight does not work. We will explain what you need to check. It could be of course the bulb, but if that doesn't fix the problem, whatever we see here in the garage and why in some cases you may need a scanner to fix that. We'll talk about that, where you can buy cheap parts, tools, fuses, relays at a good price, quick shipping, that way you do not waste money and time. And why it's always a good idea to test fuses and relays, all that will be covered absolutely free for your convenience, make sure you stay until the end. So before we start, let us tell you a little bit about us guys. If you have that generation for an escape from year 2013 to 2019, this specifically is pre-facelifted version, this is the facelifted version. There will be some minor differences, we'll talk about that, but we'll make a video about every single possible fuse, relay, why we do that. Let's say guys, you are down the road in the middle of nowhere, you need to find where the fuse for fuel pump or engine starter is located, or relay for radiator fan, you can just search that on our channel, watch the video for less than one or two minutes find out where it is replace it in your back on the road we do that to save you money guys every single car we get here at the garage we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos why we guys do that because our mission here at the shop is to save you as much money as we can and we guys have more than 12,000 free repair videos on our youtube channels as well that can save you more than thousands of dollars in future repairs if you guys need to buy any parts tools fuses relays at a good price quick shipping that way you do not waste your money and time we will share the links in the description of the video below for your convenience make sure you stay until the end so guys if left or right headlight does not work what you need to check we will demonstrate on that generation for the escape right here this is the model before the facelift this is after the facelift but it should work for both now guys here uh, if left or right headlight does not work, it could be a bulb. Always check the bulbs first, that's the easiest thing to do. Make sure the bulb is connected all the way because some people will not be able to see behind the headlight and they didn't install them correctly. If everything's good, what you need to do? Check the connector for the headlight, the wire. Sometimes it could be loose or it could be exposed to humidity and have some corrosion build up, especially if you live up north or in more humid climate. Next, you need to open the hood. If you open the hood now, guys, uh, here, okay, on the driver's side, you have that fuse box. Open that cover and you'll find a fuse box with a layout like this one. Before we continue, let's explain quickly why it's always a good idea to test fuses and relays. So let me explain why it's super important guys to test fuses. Fuses, not often you can see if they're burnt or they're good. Sometimes they may seem perfectly fine, you think it's a good fuse, you put it back in and you end up uh, spending money and time on parts and problems that uh, do not exist guys when all you have to do, test your fuse, find out it's bad, replace it, fix your problem. So we will have a video how to test the fuse, okay, different kinds of fuses and how to test relays guys. We're going to put the link in the description of the video below specifically to that video please check it out for the headlight guys we need to check four different fuses three in this fuse box then we need to go to a different one all of those needs to be checked you may have all of them you may have just some depending on which headlight option you have oh and by the way if you need to buy any fuses relays parts tools at a good price quick shipping that way you do not waste money and time we're going to put a link in the description of the video below check it out that way you do not waste money and time here if we come guys what we need to check okay we're going to come in that section right here if we zoom in we need to check fuse number 39 right here and that's fuse number 42 43 you may have that fuse 39 43 you need to check guys fuse number 24 it will be in that lower section here so that's 2021 20, that's 24 that 5m fuse here next you need to open the passenger door here on the passenger side under the dash if you look upside down on the bottom of the dash we have one soft carpet liner attaches with two turning knobs unscrew them pull that carpet liner down and you have a hidden fuse box that looks like this one here you will need to check one more fuse and that's fuse 
number guys 74 the, num the number of the fuse will be printed in the top right corner here that fuse will need to be checked if that doesn't fix the headlight on some newer vehicles guys what you have to do if you had a fault in the system you may need to reset the bcm clear the codes and that may fix it we had that happen quite often on newer vehicles if there was a problem with the headlight if the bulb was disconnected anything like that those are the most common things we see at the garage other things could be a headlight switch as well but usually it will cause both headlights not to work hopefully the video will be helpful thank you for watching see you next time